Lights, camera, action. <laughs> What's up, everybody? It's Africa G with my one and only sister. Well, Hi, no, not my one and only sister because I really do got another sister. And I got another one coming in, walking in right now. Jazz! Hi. But basically, y'all, I am back with another video. And I think this video is going to be a lot of fun. Jazzy's oh. over here falling and shit. Jazzy, you okay? <laughs> Yeah. Jazzy, literally, I wish you guys would have seen. It. Okay, I need a little water because I'm a little dehydrated. Make sure if you haven't drank your water. This is a good reminder right now. Put the video on pause. Go get some water. Your wallets because you're going to need that. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Anyways, today's video is me spending $1,000 at Sephora. It, it was actually more than 1000 But we won't get into that. And um, in my defense, in my defense, um some of it is christmas gifts well for two people it's mm -hmm. a christmas gift and um i'm gonna show it but i'm not gonna say who it's for i am gonna show you guys i did pick out three things i got out already because i wanted to do my foundation real quick i'm not gonna be showing every product and stuff like that but i am gonna be playing along with it with uh victoria and stuff she already mm -hmm. has makeup on yeah. um but i have been hearing about the dior foundation being like extra bomb so you know i decided why not give it a try you know um and then forever skin glow also another thing that we'll be doing we'll be answering questions oh yes we are going to be answering questions at the end of the video um so stay tuned for that that'll be a lot of fun so this is what it looks like and then i did get a makeup brush because you guys i had not washed mine for literally like maybe like two months and then she was like <laughs> deceased that she was dead but i don't even know if this is a foundation brush it says that's it a buffing like i guess so we're gonna it's try like it on one. yeah Woo! my little huevito fell <laughs> you guys a huevito fell you guys i applied it on my face it looks really good it's fucking amazing she like color matched she really well she really did because i feel like this is the first time in my life that it matches my like Skin neck yeah, yeah like and i feel like i look a little bit too i mean i feel like i look like white like mm -hmm. whiter than i normally do and i think it's because Your but like my skin is like lighter than light than what i think yeah. yeah you know what i'm saying yeah. like she really matched me good and it was funny because what did she say victoria she was she like was like so do you want me to match you to your foundation or to your neck because i guess the foundation was a little bit dark yeah she's like foundation or to no she's like do you want me to match you to your face or to your neck right yeah because your the face is a little dark darker <laughs> yeah than your neck and i, and was, I was like, like oh. girl i believe it but they did color match me every color she match i've really ever like had is that Sephora though? Yeah. I just feel like some of them just. I think some it's, have an eye for it. For it, yeah. Because yeah. you know what? Like, I I can't even match myself. You know yeah. what I'm saying? <laughs> like, and I, I went to makeup school, and that's the first lesson like you learn. And yeah. I just feel like it's just hard for you to. It like, is hard. For some people, it's easy. Yeah, and for me, it's really hard. You should tell them what color you're using. Cause I am something. using the color one comma five n. Yeah. So I'm 5N. Yeah, cover my face. <laughs> uh, you know what? Oh, wow. Ew, no, my nail. <laughs> Backfired on me. See, don't try to be petty, y'all, because in real life, that's what happens to you. Ten times worse. <laughs> oh, my God. So I pretty. love Jazzy. It looks yeah. bomb. Right? Yeah, it, it looks, like, so natural. Like, mm -hmm. it just yeah. matches your face. So, yes, I got this beauty blender. I usually do, like, the two for ten dollars from amazon um did i feel the difference not really and this was yeah. like 15 bucks for one um i think i'll go back to the amazon one because you know <laughs> but a brush this one really does i already had this one i think mm -hmm. and it really does like make your face like Looks smoother like but i will say though that i feel like a lot of my foundation is in there like i feel like it really does oh. people say that about this but i feel like this sucks up my foundation i did more than see that one. you see that i was like damn like, like she like, did like two pumps and she put the brush in and it soaked, sucked it, it in yeah. and then i just put it on my face i'm like i could have sworn i put like, a little more than that yeah but the maybe foundation. you need to put it on your skin first and then blend it probably that's what i probably need to do honestly because but yeah so these are the first three products and now we're gonna get into the fun stuff because thousand dollars and motherfucking sephora bitch so i got this ghd 
Is it GHD? Mm -hmm. Yeah, GHD, a professional performance one inch styler. Um, my hair stylist Maribel uses this on me and I love how my curls come out. Plus I was long overdue for a straightener. Um, I've heard, yeah, I've heard amazing things about this brand, like amazing things. And um, not only that, but like I literally had not had a new straightener in over like four years i honestly think i'm the same like i bought my straightener a long time, time ago and i'm just like i'm always like well i have a straightener and it works like pretty good so mm -hmm. why am i gonna buy a new one but like this one protects like the heat like it's already like that protecting heat plus i use product on my hair so mm -hmm. i forgot how much this one was maybe i can see the full receipt on the receipt oh shit it was expensive really yeah. it's 250 dollars. i just felt like if i'm gonna buy a straightener and i haven't bought one in four years i might as well get the best one right it's so fine. that's what i did but the next thing we got is this Huda Beauty, what's it called? The Reach Mercury Retrograde. Mm -hmm. The boxing is everything. Like, mm -hmm. look at the lights and everything. It's so beautiful. Matches with my $100 bill. Mm -hmm. This was a gift I got with the lip. Um, oh my god, it's already dirty with all my pink hair. Ew. <laughs> but I thought this packaging was so cute. And when they open this and they have this together, I think they'll That's really so like cute. it. And I also got um the Carly Bible. Yes. Oh, that's how you say it. Bible. Carly Bible palette. Um, I'm not gonna open it because this too was a gift. Yeah. Um, alongside with the lip as well. Then I got this cute, um, it's not even cute, it's just like to wash my brushes because I promised myself that I was going to start, you know, clean my brushes and stuff. That's so handy. Yeah, because I have another one and mm -hmm. it was used and abused. Cleaning your brushes is like part of skin routine and yeah. Look how bad this was. <laughs> like, you know, I, I was due for a new one because yeah. this is disgusting. It even smell bad. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> Let me throw that over there. Okay. All right. Let's see what we got next. So I got this. Thanks to Victoria. Oh, I know. She literally, literally hands me this. <laughs> I know. I'm never taking Victoria with me shopping ever again because she made me spend a lot of money yesterday. Yeah. Because... But okay. So I kidding. remember I sprayed this on me and she just she has was complimenting one. me over the smell. So yeah oh and it was on checkout it was literally like on top of the section where they have all those little samples and that's Sephora where it got me fucked up because that yeah. little section i think i got like like four or five four or five things from there and i'm just like mm -hmm. damn like i was fine without them oh it's so cute and teeny weeny it's travel size it's travel size oh you yeah. shouldn't rub you oh yeah oh, because i heard it breaks up like the molecules <gasps> So oh better. my god, this smells, yeah, smells, smells good. Really good. It smells really good. Okay, this That's is a black. No, but this smells. No, I no, know. Yeah. This is the one Victoria has. This is oh, the one. That one is Monteris. Monteris, whatever the fuck. Is it cool? It's bomb. <laughs> it's very bomb. <laughs> you take this off and then you put it on. <gasps> Victoria's oh, yeah. over here. I okay. remember my mom showed me that. Scientist bitch. Over yeah, here yeah. discovering things. <laughs> Friend, I think this one's a little more flowery. Yeah, feminine. And then this one's more like a woman. Yeah, like a whole ass woman. Like a married woman. Like <laughs> this is something I'd wear. But not really because I got a little both in me. I'm just kidding. <laughs> when are y'all planning on having little ones? So I feel like we joke around a lot. We always say that we want babies, but... Honestly, probably like two to three years. I think for Victoria, two mm -hmm. to three years. I think for me, maybe Longer. like seven years, <laughs> realistically. Just kidding, y'all. I'm just really not ready for a kid right now. Um, I think that maybe like in three to four years. But then who knows? I might pop up pregnant next week. I know. Honestly, it will happen kidding. when it happens. happens. I say that, but realistically, we never like I, I guess you do know because like mm -hmm. you want to plan a baby you don't want to just yeah. be surprised and i'm a mom now no i yeah. don't want that but um it would be nice to plan it but it's just it, gonna happen when it happens yeah so yeah. not anytime soon though okay so i got these like lip combos i was telling victoria i really don't have lip like um like like lipstick lipsticks and stuff i do have a lot but not that like variety. combo. yeah i don't have a variety so I got these and 
I think they're like really cute. I like a lot of browns and nudes and stuff. So yeah, I think it, it makes me look like I have no lips. I really yeah. don't like it. I think yeah. I thought maybe it was going to be a little more... um like a le less nude because i think in the and more pinky you yeah i thought it was because in this color i don't know i don't think it was the color i was looking for but it's okay mm -hmm. yeah. is this a gloss or what wow, is really pretty looking. yeah i i feel like i'm a gloss girl see this mm -hmm. is cute yeah if cute. i put a good color underneath this like a nice liner to make yeah like a nice like... liner and a nice like base mm -hmm. and then this on top Gorgeous. would be really cute mm -hmm. All right, next question. What's your skincare routine? I'm going to do a whole video about that. Yeah, Africa is going to do a whole video, like more in depth and kind yeah. of like take you along. Yeah. Um, someone asked if we would have a double wedding. Hell no, we would not have a double wedding. I would not have. No, me and Victoria, that's your own special, special day. Occasion. It should yeah. just be like your day. Maybe like if I was a twin and then still like twins are still, very I like. probably like, wouldn't. Yeah. Do you I, want your own day? What do yeah, you actually, yes. Like, you honestly, know? I think like the only exception I feel like would be cool is like mm -hmm. if. You know, there's like those twins and twins that marry each other. That would be like, cool. That would be cool, because right? Because that's like a lot of love and it's very unique. Unique and very mm -hmm. like together. Like, mm -hmm. you know, you're uniting like the you know, like same families. person. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I think that'd be cool. But me and Victoria joint wedding. Hell no. Oh. Uh, uh. Maybe in another world and another planet, but not. If we were twins yeah. and then uh, Victor and Anthony, Anthony were twins, twins then, then maybe. But <laughs> but honestly, <laughs> me and Victoria are so different. Like we yeah. are very, we're, we're like complete different. opposites. Mm -hmm. But I think that complements each other. Like we complement yeah. each other very well. I feel well. like we would want to hype the other person up so much on their wedding day that it just like... It would it wouldn't be as fun because we want to hype each other up I exactly know, like sense. and plus like I feel like what theme would like you think you would have your wedding like I honestly like I'm so not Africa like like yeah, I would want to like, have my wedding like in a vineyard or like something really like low key and where and do then, you see me having my like wedding? a fucking like palace <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, mm -hmm. though, a vineyard no. is that like with like flowers? Like, I want and like a bunch of flowers. Me too, lights. though. Actually, yeah. maybe we could oh. work this out. Maybe okay. we could have a joint wedding. No, my mm -hmm. dream wedding. Well, not my dream wedding because I, you know, like um, my actually, I think I'm gonna confuse a lot of people because I'm married. Okay, so Africa, she's married, but there wasn't a ceremony. There wasn't a ceremony at all. It's like me and Anthony ran away, you know, in the woods, in the Surprise. forest, and then you know we. That's honestly kind of Locked what happened. Up. You guys need to talk about. Yeah, like, we should, but we didn't tell the single soul. I don't mm -hmm. even think I told you a different date. I told you it was gonna be the fourteenth, and then we did it, and they were like, it's and then I was and home. And she's they like, come no back. way. They come back like they went to the gym. Mm -hmm. And they're like, I'm, we're married. And I'm like, what? She did not believe it. I'm like, She's like, no fucking way. And we're like, mm -hmm. yeah. We actually have footage of that and we're cracking up the whole time. Like, it's like you the have most. Footage of it? We have footage of the actual wedding. And when they said, you may now kiss the bride, me and Anthony look at each other and start cracking oh up. Like, we're God. laughing. Like, and then the whatever guy mm -hmm. is like, he's like, like, kiss. Yeah. And we're just cracking up. I'm Aww. like, wait, give me a second. This is fucking hilarious. Like, That's I don't know, just crazy. hearing that word. So funny, but... um, Honestly, you both need to do, like, a video together, and then you guys insert some footage. No, literally, we should. I yeah. will. I will. Maybe I'll... Maybe I'll... Maybe. 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 But maybe. this is a for face. Oh, I think this is... um. I don't even know what the fuck this is, y'all. Is that a fresh? Oh, is this... It says she's... Oh, she's extra? Oh, I'm so fucking extra. I definitely got some extra shit, y'all. I love it. This is so, <laughs> so bomb. Cute. Oh my god, what do you? Oh, it's because oh, it has this. So I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's but defective. it has a whole thing. <laughs> defective. <laughs> Patrick. That's so bitch. Hold up. Give me a moment. It'll be fun because you know you. Want... I've been going like this. Like, I know, literally. That's like, perfect. No, that's perfect. Yeah, for real. That's an investment, bitch. Right. What are we doing for Christmas? um we are i am hosting christmas in my house for my family the thing is me and anthony we're going to join our families together mm -hmm. but it's too many people it's a whole ass venue yeah. at that point like our house is big but our family is way bigger mm -hmm. and it's just too many people so we're gonna yeah. go to anthony's family's uh mm -hmm. 
Christmas party. Anthony and Victor's. If that like, Anthony helps and Victor's, them understand. Yes. Yeah. Anthony and Victor's mm -hmm. Christmas uh, family party because they started really early and yeah. my family, thank God, started so really, really late. late. So nobody's going to be at my house until like 8 or 9. I got this um, lip uh, thing. Like I said, I wanted a variety. And I was telling Victoria what I really mm -hmm. came to look for was like lip bundles like this. I didn't want to get individual ones unless I tried it out, but I don't want to mm -hmm. be there trying out like a bunch of things. Like we were Christmas this is shopping. Good because I mean, it's a are you really gonna use the whole tube unless it's your favorite? Yeah, that, no. that's how you discover your favorite. Exactly. Favorites. See, I want to try this one. This that's color, beautiful. this little one. I want to see how it how it looks. Let's see. Oh, see, so this it, is beautiful. Oh wow! I love Who is this. This? Color. this is Kat Von D. Yeah. This is so pretty. I could have had uh thirty percent off all her products for the rest of my life if it weren't for me dropping out of makeup school. <laughs> but it's okay. Things happen for a reason. Yeah, I legit dropped out of makeup school, and I love that color. I love it. You should try it on. Try it on. Okay. Or you want to try another one? Let's have Victoria uh, try something on. This is beautiful. A one. <gasps> this like is a different beautiful. brand. Since you want to try that you like okay. it, you know? This is gorgeous. Like this is yeah, a very really beautiful color for like it went one like swipe. That was pretty like good. Like, yeah, I'm gonna keep it until the until next you find time. something. Yeah, because yeah. that was bomb. All right, so next what we got. This was for free actually because we we bought I forgot what thing, but it was a Pat uh yeah. Pat McGraw. Yeah, Pat? but I don't want to really try it. Oh yeah, we bought the I Pat McGrath that. or something like that. And so like we got these two for free, but they're like a little pink. Um, oh, yeah. This is I only, books, though. I don't even know what it is. I think it is books. Someone asked, um, did we get along right away? No, I hated this bitch. I hated her so much. I was like, who is she? Who does she think she is? I'm just kidding, y'all. No, we literally have never gotten in a fight. I know. Ever. I mean, obviously, we're just kind of like, ugh. It's not a fight. Sometimes we're just kind of it's like, like sisterly love. love. Yeah, sometimes know. we kind of like have different views and we're di very mm -hmm. different people. And sometimes yeah. I'll just be like, Ugh, or she'll be like, okay, I'm just, you know, I'm just mm -hmm. going to exit right now and yeah. just go to my room and I'm going to let. Cause <laughs> we should do some story times of like our, like, fights or fight they're, they're not even they're fights. not even fights though that's the mm -hmm. thing but they're kind of silly like they're yeah they're so funny. silly like that when we talk about it it's hilarious it's probably like they're gonna be but like oh, I that's it i want to see y'all put the pause on each other and that's never gonna happen i'll put I the know. pause on you before i yeah. put the pause on her i'm just kidding <laughs> i'm just kidding <laughs> but yeah so mm. next i have this perfume i didn't even know that you got that it's the flower bomb from Victor. I don't know. Yeah. Flower bomb Victor and Victor and Rolf. Yeah. I'm gonna just spray this like all over. Mm. Ooh, that kind of hit me hard. <laughs> really? It's like up my nose, but it smells really okay. good. It smells good. That's mm -hmm. I actually smelt it. Yes. Yeah, because it, it had really a sample good. thing, mm -hmm. and I was like, let me smell it, and it smells good. It smells really good, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I'm gonna get one of these two because they're all so bomb i love perfumes oh my god okay what is this patrick ta this is uh she's strong and honey yes i am i'm strong <laughs> physically mentally emotionally all the above period so oh this is a lip liner the lip liner victoria you want to try this one? Oh, i like it because you have to go like this look i'm gonna get some of your can i get some of your yeah i'm about to get some of this this looks good um, how did the bond between y'all begin? Was it shy and awkward or straight love? Mm, I think shy. I wouldn't say awkward. No. But Victoria is really reserved at first. Yeah. She's very to herself. She didn't really ask questions. Mm -hmm. And I'm kind of like loud and like, hi, I'm here. I'm just mm -hmm. kidding. But I, I feel like you were very shy at first too. Though. Yeah, I moved in when victoria was already living here mm -hmm. so i went i came into her house but she only had what like a month living here yeah but when you first like started um coming to the house a lot i you were shy like you I didn't want to come down i didn't come downstairs or nothing mm. it's not that you were a shy person it's just I don't that think you were shy you were i was just more yeah i was a yeah. little like i didn't feel like it was my home yet because yeah my other home you had your family your dad mm -hmm. 
I would just walk in there, you know, my PJs, be like, what's up, everybody? And mm -hmm. here, I felt like I moved into someone's home. Yeah. You know, like, it wasn't really my home. But it took time, and then I ended up buying... There was, like, no furniture when I came here. Mm -hmm. At all. No TV, no furniture, no yeah. nothing. There is and when nothing. I got here, I'm like, okay, this needs to become a home. Mm -hmm. So we went shopping for a couch and a TV mm -hmm. and a stand and a mirror and everything. Yeah. And I, like, stocked up, like, cleaning supplies, stocked up the fridge. There was already, obviously, food in the fridge they eat, yeah. right? But I did, like, all this, and Victoria was, like, I remember, she's, like, oh, my God, thank God he moved in. <laughs> huh, because, and we just, like, get what uh, Victor and I needed. And then, but it wasn't, like, a home. It was just pretty much, like, me and Victor. And then, like, Tony was never home because he was always busy. Or with me. Or with you, yeah. Did you try it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. Yeah, it's it's so pretty. Mm -hmm. I'm happy about that. What's next? Victoria put me on this one. This is um, a shade. What yeah, shade 79. A lot of people ask if we live in the same house, and yes, we do. Mm -hmm. We live, Um, I live with Victor, which is her husband's brother. brother. And they're a year apart. They're a year apart. So and me and Victoria time. are two years apart. Yeah, I'm 25. Yeah. She's 23. She just yeah. turned 23. All right, so let's try this on. It looks already so pretty like this. It's so, like, aesthetically pleasing. Like, Let me see. Beautiful. <gasps> it's so easy to put on. Yeah. It's, like, so smooth. Everyone it, like, loves rolls. it. <gasps> oh, yeah, this is so cute. Mm -hmm. I don't feel like my lips, like, um like dry like mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying like when it's dry and it's hard and you're like oh shit there goes mm -hmm. like a whole like this is bomb actually i really like this one yeah it's so bomb i like the color too mm -hmm. i feel like it matches my hair oh it does what the hell mm -hmm. all right so that's that i actually like it but i do have another lipstick right here do you have a favorite foundation i forgot um I really haven't found, like, that one where I refuse mm -hmm. to move on to, like, another one, right? Mm -hmm. But I do have a few that I actually do like. Um, I really like the Lawless Foundation is what I use, like, on my everyday makeup, really, and even when I go out. Mm -hmm. And then I really do like the Frankie Rose. I tried the Fenty Foundation. I felt like she's an amazing person, but I needed something a little more full coverage and mm -hmm. the... Uh, Fenty foundation didn't really do that for me. Plus, I like dewy natural makeup looks and not matte. And hers is a matte. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I was like, um, it's cool, but not for it's me. Like you a know, preference. I actually think the Dior foundation you can Might build be it almost on your top so far. Yeah, well, it you'll is. Have to see how it wears. It but. wears, yeah. But I really do like it, and I. But I feel like it's not full coverage, but it mm -hmm. covers enough for me. Mm -hmm. So I really like it. Uh, she's an influencer. Sir, I'm a fucking influence. That's us, baby. That's us. I'm just kidding. Okay, so this one is a she's an influencer one. Wow. Let's see. This is so, so pretty. pretty. Yeah. Uh, this is bomb. Yeah. I really like this. I feel like if I would have had the YSL under and this on top, it would have been really cute. Didn't you? No, I took it off because I oh, thought it was okay. going to be a little more um pigmented yeah but i well, like that it's a glass. remember that you gloss. did this liner and then oh the and that one yeah that's true i got another one she's independent that's victoria because i'm married <laughs> i'm just kidding <laughs> i'm still you could still be independent if you're married actually they're asking about your nationality and where our families are from okay so my nationality is straight mexican like straight off the boat honey <laughs> like yeah that's my nationality hispanic latina yes and then um my dad was uh born in nicaragua so he's nicaraguan and then my mom she was born in ireland and she's irish and italian yeah so she's a little mix she's a little mutt yeah. i like this one but i feel like i need a liner with it like I, this is a nude i actually like could work with you know what i'm saying like do you like it victoria i love it i love it That's i love a it too really pretty color i feel like if i try it on with this let's see Wow, that one's really nice. Yeah, that complements like your skin tone a lot. Yeah, like these these are the kind of nudes I could do. You should have never do liner after. See, it made it pop. Yes. 
All right, so that does it for the first bag, but honey, we got two bags. <laughs> oh, why do you take, that? yeah, we could. Why do you take credit for Anthony's products? That's because we built it together. So when we, we were already married, no, were we already married? Uh, in yeah, we were, yeah, we were already married. And um, everything from the logo to the name to the colors to everything we did together. And I don't take percentage off of his product, but I support it a thousand percent because it's very much his product and my product together because we built it together. Even Victoria, even Victor, like he'd ask questions mm -hmm. and she'd have suggestions. Victor would have suggestions. I'd have suggestions and we built it together. So I don't take credit like, mm -hmm. oh yeah, I built that shit. I'm a fucking entrepreneur. No, absolutely not. But you tell me if you don't have a husband who already has a product or brand and everything, you're mm -hmm. not gonna support it. But I'm also, I feel like people just need to be a little quick reminder that like that is your husband, like you're his wife. That's going to be the future father I mean, of my kids. I'm yeah. the future mother of his kids. Like, like she's like locked down. Whatever she is going to build is also going to be a part of him because they're such big parts of yeah. each other's life. You and know? we're working on something I'm building. Yeah. And, you know, I'm not going to talk about it now until everything is set. But, mm -hmm. um, yeah, I'm always going to support my husband to the yeah. death of me. And, and his product, anything he, anything he comes out with is very much mine because i'm part of every single thing yeah. that he does he asks everything. for your advice yeah everything. and yeah so and then there's like another part and then they're asking did me, anthony help with your new fit plan oh yeah so um with i have a program that i came out with um so someone's asking if anthony helped me out with it and i honestly kept it a secret for a while mm -hmm. like i well, not like not because I didn't want them to know She's just about it. She's a very it. private person in yeah. general, like in I'm, general. I'm already just like pretty private, and I I just don't like a lot of um, attention on me, I guess. So like I didn't want it to be something that was talked about a lot in the house, because then I'd feel a little bit overwhelmed or a little mm -hmm. bit like pressured. But Do you then, guys want to know something funny though? Like mm -hmm. I knew you were working on the plan. Yeah. Before you came out with yeah, telling me because you just she know left. me though. Like, I know you, but yeah. I respected the privacy. Mm -hmm. And in this house, like there's no competition. No, it's at so all. amazing. Yeah. Like, there's, I don't even know how to help describe each, it. Yeah, we all help each other out. Mm -hmm. It's like there's enough space in this world, let alone this household, mm -hmm. for everyone to be great in whatever and whatever they love choose. Each other and yeah. support each and other. so, so mm -hmm. I'll kind of finish like yeah, yeah. So um, I just kept it a secret until I completed it, mm -hmm. and then that was it. And then all they did was support me. So it was yeah. only me. And then Victor, my boyfriend, helped me out so much. Mm -hmm. So it was kind of like our thing. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Mm -hmm. and just like um, I came out with a plan, and let's say Victor was like, "Yeah, we came out with one." I would completely agree with him. Because yeah. it was both of us. Just like Africa said that her and Anthony came out with the products. It is both of them. Exactly. Because they help. we help each other. Exactly. Yeah, I think that mm -hmm. we are very blessed to be living. But we're not just roommates. We're like family. Like yeah. this is my real sister. It really feels in law. Like and we'll drop the in-law mm -hmm. because I feel like... Like, we live together. Mm -hmm. I see her every morning. I see her yeah. every night before bed. We spend a lot of our time together. Mm -hmm. um, and we support what everybody does. There's no animosity. There's no hate. And I think that's the best it's blessing. It's like, like a breath of fresh air yeah. almost. Yeah. You need to surround yourself with people mm -hmm. that are just like that. Because if you have low-key haters yeah. or people that would be like, yeah, yeah, but like be talking behind your back or anything yeah. like that, with much love, mm -hmm. Cut them out of your life. Yeah. Because honestly, that's the most... Like, energy is like... There's like a mm -hmm. new science re revelation that energy is really transferred. Yeah, and when you is. have that negativity around, it's really going to affect you. It does mm -hmm. energy-wise. And it you will know what slowly do it. Mm -hmm. Like, you won't even notice at first. And then all of a sudden, you're exactly. in this like... In this whole thing. Yeah. Um, I also got these little like samples of these colors. I don't see a way to open this and I'm too lazy to go downstairs to get the maybe, scissors. Maybe so. I could like look at it for you. Yeah, just look at it for me. Oh, you do have eyelash scissors, don't you? Yeah. Oh yeah, but do you think that'll work? Yeah. 
I also got these lip combos. I'm going to try one that I really want to try from here. I think these are glosses, though. These are, like, really oh, cute glosses. Really pretty. Yeah, I love these. Um, which one should I try, Victoria, right now? Um, this one's talking Yeah, to I was me. literally, huh. like, this one's talking to me. It was talking to the both of us. It really was. I'm going to try this one on. This color looks so pretty. It matches my robe. Like, why not? I was going to do the other one. I but was I feel like, like I'm doing like that, but it's the same color. Yeah, it's the same colors that we've been doing because I really like browns. Oh, I like this. That's beautiful. With a color underneath, too. Oh like, you guys gosh. have to understand, like, that's just this is so lips. pretty. Yeah, this is my lip. That's gorgeous. I do naturally already have, like, reddish lips, mm -hmm. like, very pigmented lips, but this is really pretty. I really like this one. That's gorgeous. I got them out. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh, this is Pat McGrath. Pat like, McGrath. Little, oh, little that's combo. the one? No, we didn't. No, we, the oh, Pat McGrath powder. is right here. <gasps> oh, okay. I know. That's We have like Bomb. a showcase for you. <gasps> are these lip plumpers? My lips are starting to tingle. Yeah, Buxa is oh, known yeah. for that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, these are lip plumpers. Wow, oh, let me take cute. this one off before my lips get big. I'm just kidding. <laughs> like, no, I'm just kidding. Kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, but okay. you try one on of these. Okay. While I look for questions. Do you like, okay, I'll answer this one. Do you okay. like Gymshark? What is your favorite athletic wear? Um, I'm going to be very truthful here, and everyone is different. Everyone likes different things. Mm -hmm. But I personally have only bought in, like, three things from Gymshark. And um, I think it looks really nice, but it's actually pretty uncomfortable to wear for me. Um I don't like the inside quality of it because it's just like not comfortable for me. Um, and I felt like the bottoms fit me so tight, but the shirts fit me big. Oh. So I think, you know, there was a little um, in proportion like in that sense, but so would I buy again? Um, yeah i would actually because it still looks cute mm -hmm. but i want something comfortable i have this urge not urge but like i like looking good i yeah. like you know once after the gym it doesn't end there then we have to go grocery shopping then we have to do this and we have to do that mm -hmm. yeah make it look cute but let's be comfy um i did get the same huda beauty as the gifts i got for oh yeah you did the people um i'm not gonna try lips on again because i feel like i've been trying them on already your lips are rough now. yeah <laughs> like they're sticky they <laughs> need an exfoliant now <laughs> just kidding but oh my god i am so excited i literally waited for like this to be the last project project yeah. piece on purpose because if it weren't for victoria i wouldn't have bought it but honestly like i would just walk by and i was like whoa like, and the colors were so beautiful and then this is how you open it like oh like how many, and that's just the packaging. presentation yeah that's like, not even the presentation yet. like oh shit and this is like oh see i like this it has like the shades in there already mm. as well and this is just like beautiful like oh it's a little dirty because of me <laughs> i'm just kidding <laughs> but oh, yeah. wow. oh my god this is like to die for and i think this palette was 130 dollars mm -hmm. but let me show you guys something like Right? We go in here and we don't even do like that much or that hard. And let me do another color. Like, let's do this rose gold right here. And then check this out, y'all. Look, y'all. Look how beautiful oh that color is. And that's what's you should so... Put some, like, on your lid. I should, huh? Mm -hmm. Should I do this one? Okay, yeah. I'm going to do this first and then yeah. I'm going to do that. And Can then look at this. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I love that one. Look at how bomb. I feel like it doesn't even do justice no. on camera. But like I dead ass fell in love with this color. Mm -hmm. When I saw them, I was like, I need to have this. Yeah, they're and so pretty. They're so beautiful. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And we fell in love with it, both me and Victoria. And I said, <laughs> why not, Victoria? <laughs> why not, honey? Why not? Treat I know you're good. <laughs> Why not treat us both? Because you know damn well we both gonna be using this shit. <laughs> I'll be like Africa. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> but honestly, I'm so excited for everything I got. I it was so funny because when I was in line, I was like, all right, you know, um you know when you go on um 
in the front of the line and i had my full like literally nothing fit everything was like mm -hmm. piled up i was dropping shit i'm like oh shit you know that's enough that's mm -hmm. enough and like, i should i put back yeah and i'm like okay i'm gonna you know like um i'm not gonna get everything because honestly mm -hmm. i think i went a little too crazy like i went go i went there looking for christmas gifts and mm -hmm. i ended up christmas shopping for myself yeah. and honestly i was like okay i need to leave some stuff so as i'm thinking of what to leave i literally was like i ain't leaving shit because i need all of this <laughs> <laughs> victoria it's so funny. i'm like <laughs> I was like waiting I can't for you to zoom in on that part. Like, <laughs> we wanted to answer this question because um I'll answer why first I'm gonna read the question. It says, okay. Do both of y'all have any flaws at all? Because you guys seem perfect. Now I wanna stress out that I don't think anybody is perfect. Like no. I think everybody though is beautiful in their own damn way. You know, I feel like as confident as a woman can be, because I I consider myself pretty confident yes um there's still things i wish i could change you know but i think that's everybody mm -hmm. and i really wish i could change because i would have done it by now but like for example i have this dermal scar that i hate right i got a dermal piercing and anthony actually took it out <laughs> by accident you know hugging me and i've learned to just not care about it not care what people say i just really don't care I could have, I could be looking for ways to take it out, but I just don't feel like the rush, like I need to do it. Mm -hmm. So I'm not perfect. I don't think anyone's perfect. I think yeah. you just got to accept your flaws. Um, I mean, if there's bad characteristics, try to work on them. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, obviously everyone has their own insecurities, but we're not going to put them on blast, you know, like why do that? Just feel confident in yourself just love your insecurities eventually yeah, love your insecurities so nobody mm -hmm. has power over you yeah you know what i'm saying like once you start it like loving what people make fun of you for then mm -hmm. you become like you take control of yeah. everything and yeah i just want to say thank you all for tuning in with me i hope you guys enjoyed this as much as i did um it was so fun being with you it was fun having you here this is like real life like i know we'd like be here without the camera like oh real life like <laughs> let's try it all like uh -huh. and we were gonna do that and then i'm like should i film it for youtube and she's like yeah and i'm like yeah i should yeah why not Constance. yes <laughs> okay love y'all thank you for tuning in bye bye